What? Oh, look at that. Wow, that is nice, huh? That is really cool. How strong is it? Yeah, that'll hurt. That'll hurt if I hit you. Bang. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Look at that. You've never seen this on my channel, on any lights I've reviewed. That is interesting. This next torch, TA30C with the FR1 adapter, which is this really cool ring here, is what we're looking at today. Welcome back, everybody. Tim here from the Tactical Defender. And yes, this is probably, actually, I think it is, the first Next Torch flashlight you've ever seen on my channel. And I look, I have two of them just came in for review. And I got to be honest, I don't know why I haven't taken a look at these earlier. What a really nice light. I like this. Now, the FR1 attachment. The tactical ring, if you want to call it. This is plastic, and we will discuss that in a minute, but that does come separate. It's only a $10 item. I definitely suggest getting that if you pick up this light. But, wow, that is really – and it's plastic, but I'm telling you, I hit you with that. You're going to feel it. huh? 1,600 lumens momentary on, and then the strobe – all the way on. And it, the whole back button here is momentary, right? It doesn't click. All the way on, you have to hold it. You release it, it's just going to shut up. Hold it. You have your strobe. Momentary on. There is your, your turbo 1600 lumens. What? That is really sharp. I like that a lot. I do. Let's look at the box. Now, this is kind of cool. The battery came in this little thing on the side here. And and anyway, it, it, it wasn't easy getting that out, but I got the battery out. It does come with a battery. One step stroke tactical flashlight, huh? huh? And I'm going to show you how to take uh, what it looks like, more or less, if you decide not to get the tactical ring there. Nice. Nice 1600 lumens. The lowest is 20 lumens. And uh, you're looking at a 22,950 Duke Candela. So nice packaging. What is in said packaging? So this came with the light, obviously. Don't need that. Now this takes an 18650 which it comes with, but you can also use the CR123A, I believe they are. Uh, and there's a little sleeve because you got to put that down in there. And then, you, yeah, you get it, right? Put that to the side. What is in this bag of goodies? Destructions. You do have a lanyard should you need one. I never, ever, 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 ever use them. You do have your typical, oh, it is USB-C charging and is your typical, like, three-inch cord, <laughs> they, right? They really are. So, and you have a couple extra uh, rubbers here. Yes, that's why I said rubbers. There you go. And this, just we'll go over the boxes first. Tactical flashlight ring. It is plastic. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, I'll show you how that goes off and on. And it's really cool. I mean, it really is more or less uh, comfortable to wear. I'm just going to put that right over there. So here's their website. You know I like to do this. You're looking at $100 or $95, okay? Patent one-step strobe technology. Tap for momentary on and uh, tactical strobe. Coated temperature. Tempered glass, super hard ceramic strike tips. <laughs> hey, you got to have, you see those there? Those are ceramic. Sorry, don't have any glass to try those out. We're going to have to take their word for it, right? And we go down 1600 lumens. You already know that stuff. It does have a rotational dial magnetic switch, innovative interference reductor, magnetic technology. 
I'm not even going to go there. 303 meters for your 1,600 lumens. See? See? It breaks glass. See? There's your battery. And you can see here when the tail light, <clears throat> the tail switch, which is right there. All right, 75 to 100%, it will be blue. Looks more like a purple to me, a blue flash, 50 to 75%, 25 to 50% red light and red flash means you got nothing. I got nothing. Comes with a clip, does come off should you want it to. There are a number of accessories. You got different holsters. Uh, there is a, let's go down here. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. You can put that on the end of your rifle. You can use the tactical ring. And this is what you all wanted. Light output 1600 lumens for the momentary on and tactical strobe. And uh, high is the 1600 lumens for two hours and 30 minutes. Two hours and third. I think that's the longest I've ever heard of. Medium, 330 lumens for four hours and 30 minutes. Low, 20 lumens for 50 hours. Hello, and strobe is 1600. Your uh, runtime there, we did. Beam distance, 303 is max. Beam intensity, 22,000. 952 candela impact resistance is very uh, standard two meters submersible ipx8 again very standard there's your weight dimensions light sources are luminous sst40 led aluminum alloy batteries in 18650 or 2cr123a using that sleeve as i said um i do believe if you use a cr uh, one, two, three, A, you're not going to have the normal uh, 1,600 lumens, right? You're not. And again, if I didn't already say, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? And they got a nice website, lots of information. It is $95. They are on Amazon as well. Of course, as I always do, I will link all those down below. Now, let's look at the light. This is what you came for. There is your LED down inside with your nice, smooth reflector. Your tactical bezel with the uh, window breaker. Don't know if I'd ever need that. Thankfully, relatively smooth. There is some texturing on the side, which really is very smooth. But I'm telling you, in hand, even without the tactical ring, like it's not going anywhere. It fits in my hand really well. And there is your... Right, ready, ready. Momentary. That's your high, your your lumens, right? Your sixteen hundred, and down more is your strobe. So high, all the way down, strobe, and it doesn't click. It does not stay on. Now, if you want it to, you see this right here. There's your tack. I have it in tack mode. There is your low. Turn it again. Again, it goes up higher, okay? That is their medium. And then you, again, there's your 1600 lumens. And then again, it's strobe. Now, this is when it's just on constantly, right? You can turn that as you so wish. But personally, I like that. I really like, and I really like this tactical ring. Uh, do I need that? No, probably not. But I like it. For $10, I would definitely, absolutely add that. Now, let's, and it's almost impossible to take this off without turning the light on. It really, for me anyway, I got big fat hands. Take that off. And there is your, the FR1 tactical ring. And it is hot. Ah, yeah, see, that ain't going to break. <clears throat> That's strong. <laughs> I don't know what they use for that, but that is strong. Here is our light uh, battery. Just so you know that it is a USB-C and it is a battery charge, so you have to talk directly into the battery. Yeah. 
not crazy about that. I would like something on the outside of the light. But look, it's better than having like a wall charge. We have to take the battery out, stick it in, and then it charge that way, right? I can't stand that. But this isn't bad at all. I will take that, plug it right in, and it charges. Here is your pocket clip belt clip you can see it's just a it is a deep pocket clip but it's only a one directional right a lot of companies are coming out with uh by or multiple direction or bi-directional however you want to word it reverse pocket clip it's a good good pocket clip now let's put that back in first let's take this you will see yeah, you see that little cut out there? It goes in and it just fits, right? It just fits right on like that, and it can't rotate at all. But then you take this, doing this behind. Come on, go in, go in, go in. Do you hate when it doesn't go in? There we go. Wow, there's a lot of screwing. <laughs> there you go. On, boom, huh? That is, wow, that is bright. What a bright light, and I believe it's a great throw, which we're going to find out right now. Fantastic light. Next torch, uh, look, I'll be honest with you, I've known of them but it just didn't interest me. I've been on their site. I have another light coming up soon also to review. Woo, the E51C, which is actually right here. Another fantastic light. Great light. They're fantastic quality. If you are a light collector, you have or a uh, flashlight, flashlight to holic, as someone called it. This is definitely something that you're going to want in your collection. Absolutely. They're great lights. $100. Links in the box below. Let's take it outside and let's see what it can do.